Welcome back to Top X Mystery Research Channel. Many objects are believed to be possessed by evil supernatural entities, and the owners of these objects often claim to have seen terrifying sights and experienced horrific things. To make matters worse, many of them met bad luck or even died under very strange circumstances. Here are the 10 most cursed objects that you should never touch. A historic home and former plantation, the Myrtles Plantation in St. Francisville, Louisiana is considered one of the most haunted places in America, or even in the world. Many spooky legends surround the property. However, the scariest object in the house is the mirror. The story of the cursed mirror is one of the most famous. According to legend, the former owner of the house Sarah Woodruff and her two daughters were poisoned by their slave and trapped in the mirror. Visitors of the house say they have seen handprints, strange marks, and even figures dressed in vintage clothes lurking in the mirror. In 1849, a girl from a wealthy Pennsylvania family named Anna Baker fell in love with a lower-class iron worker. Anna's father did not want her to marry a low-class man and forbade the wedding, for which Anna had already bought a dress. His father forcibly brought her back and even locked her in the bedroom. Sad and disappointed, Anna refused to marry anyone else and decided to remain single. She spent the rest of her life alone and died a spinster in 1914. Since then, her wedding dress is said to be cursed. After her death, members of the Baker family reported seeing Anna's wedding dress in various places around the house. Some of them even saw the ghost of Anna Baker moving around the house wearing the same wedding dress. The dress is currently housed in the Baker Mansion in Altoona, USA, which has now been converted into a museum. Visitors often report seeing the dress moving in the glass box where it was displayed. A phone number is not technically a physical object, but there is a Bulgarian phone number that has been used for 10 years and is now closed. The deactivation of the number is due to the deaths of three people who used it after it was first released in the early 2000s. All owners of this number died shortly after the number was registered in their name. There is the CEO of a Bulgarian mobile phone company, who died of cancer at the age of 48, and two thugs, one a mob boss and the other a cocaine dealing real estate agent both were gunned down without any solid motive. All three died within four years of each other. The phone number has since been frozen, and the Bulgarian mobile phone company that owns it refuses to comment on why. Hope Diamond is one of the most famous gems in the world. It is unusually large, has a soothing shade of blue, and is valued at $250 million. This diamond is believed to have appeared 1.1 billion years ago, but is believed to have been cursed since the 17th century, bringing great misfortune and misery to its wearer. It traveled around the world but is now housed in the Smithsonian Natural History Museum. The most widely recognized origin of the curse dates back to 1653, when a French merchant obtained an original 115 karat blue diamond from India. Where he plucked the gem from one of the eyes of a Hindu god and was later crushed by dogs for sacrilege. Since then, anyone who wears this 115 karat blue diamond opens the door to great misfortune and misery. Commonly known as the Busby Stoop Chair, this wooden piece of furniture is cursed by the spirit of English drunkard Thomas Busby, who was known to murder people mercilessly. He sealed his fate when he killed his father-in-law, Daniel Audie, in 1702. He was executed for his crimes by hanging at a crossroads near a modest inn in North Yorkshire, UK. Before his execution, he asked to eat at his favorite local bar. After eating, he stood up and said, May sudden death come to anyone who dares sit on my chair, and since then 63 people who dared to sit on the chair have met an untimely and horrible death. However, the chair stood in the tavern until 1978. The pub owner later donated the chair to the Thirsk Museum in the UK. It is still there, hanging 1.5 meters above the ground to prevent further deaths. 
Basino vase is a carved silver vase made by an Italian maid in the 15th century. It was given to her groom on the eve of their wedding near Naples, Italy. Unfortunately, she never made it to the altar because she was murdered that night with the vase in hand. The vase was then passed from family to family, each claiming the unfortunate death of their loved ones. It was offered to several museums in 1988, but all refused to accept it because of the curse. After countless deaths, the family packed away the vase. It reappeared in 1988 with a note that read, Beware. This vase brings death. However, when the Bassano vase sold at auction for approximately $2,250, the note was omitted from the item's description. The pharmacist who bought it died within three months. Three more deaths by the new owners followed, until finally the curse appeared to be dormant when a desperate family demanded the police take it away. Its exact whereabouts now remain unclear, but some claim it is buried in a lead coffin in a hard-to-reach location. Dybbuk Box is a wine cabinet said to be haunted by a restless malevolent spirit. The box appeared in 2001 when Kevin Manis bought a wine cabinet and started having terrible nightmares. He then decided to give the cabinet to his mother, who suffered a stroke the day she received it. Not only that, but everyone who has ever owned a wine cabinet has experienced terrifying events, from terrifying nightmares to strange illnesses. The last owner of the cabinet, Jason Haxton, discovered that the box contained the spirit of an evil Jewish entity called Dybbuk, which has the ability to haunt and control the living. In 1974, seven Chinese farmers were digging a well in their village in Shaanxi when they accidentally discovered a 2200-year-old terracotta army. It is an amazingly detailed series of 8,000 sculptures that were buried for a long time as part of a grand tomb. It is unique for its 2,200 pieces of funerary art, considered one of the most massive archaeological discoveries to date, bringing researchers and busloads of tourists. However, for all seven farmers who found it, it is only a bearer of bad luck. Soon after the discovery, the government took over their farmland and their homes were demolished to make way for exhibition halls and gift shops. One of the discoverers committed suicide, and most of the rest of the crew died in poverty. A former summer cottage in Newport, Rhode Island, the Belcourt Castle has a reputation as one of the most haunted places in the United States. A ballroom with haunted chairs is the most reported paranormal activity. Some visitors reported chills running up and down their backs while standing near the chair, others reported a strange energy moving between their hands. Several guests were even kicked out of their seats by an invisible force. Little Bastard was what Dean called the silver Porsche 550 Spider, the car he was killed in a 1955 accident. The vehicle was then bought by hot rod designer George Barris, who planned to sell it for parts. The story of the curse was born when the car fell and crushed the mechanic's legs. When the car parts were sold, the curse was said to have spread. The doctor who bought the engine was killed in a traffic accident, another victim, who bought the gearbox, was seriously injured in the accident. Tires sold by Little Bastard exploded at the same time and the buyer ended up in hospital. While transporting the shell of the passenger car, the truck carrying it collided and the driver was killed. From there, the shell was stolen and the curse of the little bastard was silenced as its whereabouts remained unknown. So, which object do you think is the most cursed? Leave your answer in the comments below.